Yeah, I heard word around town is a popping now. Hey yo, what is up everybody? This is Young King Hitman here, and we are back with another Budokai Tenkaichi 4 video. Now we're gonna take Vegito into this challenge tower. These are I don't recognize these from when I was a kid, so I'm sure these are specifically from like Budokai Tenkaichi 4's team. This is challenge mode, it's a challenge tower. Basically, I'm fighting a set of themed enemies. For example, like right now I'm fighting the androids, right? Like the main fully, I don't know, like non bio androids, like Android 13, 14, 15, 16, example, right? So you guys know what I mean. Now, Vegito is for sure my best character. Like, I don't feel any concern when I'm fighting with Vegito here. It'll get progressively harder as I go through and through the fight. I'm really, I don't know how hard this is. I know that there's this universe survival saga where you fight like you like Goku and stuff like that, right? That one is hellacious. I did that one. I've been doing it off camera and it's it's so difficult. This one seems like it's gonna take a couple enemies before I really have to turn up. So we're kind of just swimming around right now. But I am loving the creativity they put into some of these modes. Yeah, I'm loving the creativity. Like, they really made it their own, right? With some of these modes and different things you could do with the game. Now, I... You know, I kind of deserve that. I was sitting there. And I didn't move. Yeah, I deserve that. Alright, let's try this a different way. You guys know we had to turn up on him. This fit looks so good when he goes Super Saiyan. You, you're kidding me. I'm not dodging right now? Thank you. Waste no time. Yeah, but Vegito's for sure my best character. Like, I've tried to use Blue Gogeta. I haven't even unlocked ever, like, Blue Vegito yet. I haven't beaten enough story mode. I've been trying to, you know, toy around with Blue Gogeta, who's usually my favorite fusion. I've been trying to toy around with the Gokus. I do like mid Goku a lot, like, it's from his fight with Frieza. That is probably my second best character, I think. Yeah, the mid Goku, he... It's him and Vegeta. They're in the tier of their own. Now, there's other characters I'll use for fun, but if I was like, yo, I gotta play somebody for $10 right now, like, those are the characters I'm going to. Now, Android 17. He can be... The Androids can be problematic because they have the traits of, like... If you see... I, maybe I'll do it during this fight, but often, like, I can break the enemy's stamina and take advantage of that and get hella, like, combo potential out of it, right? You guard crash them, and when you break their guard, they can't... Like, the most human or, like, human-like enemies, Frieza and, and Krillin and stuff like that, they'll be stunned for a good 10 seconds or whatever. With the androids, they don't have that issue, right? So right now, 17 and 18 don't seem to be the problematic enemies. But if I were to break her guard right here... Look, let me see if I can... No, she's not even trying to guard. Yeah, these... This fight is... Maybe I should, should have gone into a more difficult one. Because this one is the second out of, I think, five stages, maybe six. This one, I should have went into the universe if I was one. Like, the GT one can be a bit difficult. Vegeta, Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta was giving me hell. Okay, okay, alright. Maybe I'm speaking too soon. They always walk right into it. It's so weird. <laughs> the backhand. <laughs> alright. It's definitely still on easy right now. Like I can tell by the movement, it's still on easy. I need the enemies to go to normal and then immediately go to hard. This is this is not a problem at all. This is something I'll never win, bro. It's just impossible to win. And 57 is light. They usually way higher numbers than that 57. Android 19 is here. Use this chance to power up. I try to stay in max power mode because when you're in this mode, the, this right here, I can do this infinite combo, especially against weaker enemies who just take forever to, yeah, that block right there, they take forever to, wow, he took me out of, I didn't even know you could do that as an I didn't think you could take me out of max power or high tension, depending on what, if you're thinking Raging Blast, come on, man, yo, I'm letting them throw me, bro, alright. This is, nah, this is a joke, this is a joke, there's no way the fat clown is getting on my ass right now. 
do it. Oh, I thought I could counter it. You're kidding me right now. He's legitimately giving me problems. See, like right there, most enemies, when their key is empty like that, and I break their guard, that's when it's like, they'll be stunned for two, three, four bars of health, depending on who you're fighting. Androids don't suffer from that condition, so I can't take advantage of it the same way. It's, it's not enough. That's it? That's the fight? There's no Jero? There's no... Wow. I mean... I really just kind of hopped into this. I was hoping it would be ultra difficult, but it's not that much of a problem. Hope you guys enjoyed the content. I, of course, enjoyed showing this for you. I'm going to do more of these. I should have been able to get a Z, but I was letting 19 toy around with me. Yeah, my HP was... It shouldn't have even reached 41%. I should have been in the 60s. But it's whatever. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I enjoyed making it for you. Consider subscribing if you want more Budokai Tenkaichi 4 content. Young Hitman, he's out.